guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Holly, but you guys know me as Delsa which means I can't sleep in Korean. Today we are here to finally react to the BTS performance of Idol on America's Got Talent. May. It's been a little while. Happened on like the 12th or something of September. I'm a little bit behind. Mm. When am I not being a little bit behind? I'm, I'm not too fast with uploading these immediately once something happens. Probably should if, if I'm wanting to increase my subscriber count, but you know what? What is? Excuse the weird makeup. Um, I'm testing out a look for my icon concert that I'm going to with my fellow YouTuber, So Obsessed With, aka Amanda, a very good friend of mine, as well as another mutual of mine off Twitter, Donna, who is just. Chanyeol's wife, like that's just what it is, that's just how it is. Um, so I'm just trying out a new look, um, the septum piercing is not permanent, I just wanted to see what it looked like with it, so why not? Um, anyway, we're just going to get pretty much straight into it, I heard they did really well, um, I saw Tyra's just like fangirl meltdown on Twitter, so I'm sure it's going to be fucking fantastic, so I'm just going to get straight into it, because I'm probably going to have to watch this like three times. All the staging. Oh! <laughs> oh, wait. Wait. I just did an unboxing. This is happening. This is happening. Let's go. Let's try that again. But now, with my recently unboxed version 3 light stick, which I will have the link down in the description, hopefully if I remember to do that, uh, for my unboxing I just did for Love Yourself Answer and my beautiful new precious. Anyway, let's go. Oh, there's the outfit that went viral. I don't care. Oh, oh, oh my god, these girls are just dying. Like, I'm not dying here. Oh. How did I never notice that move? Um, no, I go back. How did I never notice that move, especially with Jungi at the front? Bam! Oh, this is just... God damn. I'm just, I'm geeking out. This is why I should never have, like, movement room. I don't know how to dance. I don't know what I'm trying right now. I'm by man. What just happened to my screen? Why did we lose audio? I might have to watch a different link after this because I don't know if that happened in it. Because I missed my Yungi part and I don't like that. Oh, the choreo for this entire thing. Oh, look at these guys. Like, the guys are even getting into it. I appreciate that. I love fanboys. They said they cut it funny. <laughs> Love 
lava from sage. You kind of get the full effect of their choreo. The good crowd pleasing choreo. Ugh. How, like, Jimin was made to stand out in that suit. Like, there's a, like, obviously he went viral a little bit, like, they're all wearing pretty muted colours compared to that. Oh, okay, so what? Sunny ovation. <gasps> Did you see Tay's face? I swear I just saw a VIP light stick. Look. Wait, yeah, look. Can I get it to... Let me see. My pause and skills. Yeah, there's a... Oh my god, right here. It's the headband, not the light stick. Ayy, I got a good eye. <laughs> so what happens here? Oh, or are we just getting... God? Bam. Love yourself, they love yourself tour, so make sure you check that out. Okay, now we are here to find out which actor. Yeah, don't care. <laughs> I stopped watching these shows years ago. Um, I'm curious if the other link for it included the. Oh, so it really cut into it. Is this why it wasn't. The other one was called Full Performance. So I'm just watching this on a different channel now because it had a weird cut. Oh, Jimin. Hang on, I want to actually watch the performance for this. I love the fact that there was like I saw pictures of the outfits. There's like a, like there's always something connecting them. It might not look like there is, but it's in the fabric. It's in the design. Like the thing on um, Namjoon's chest. I think it was. Oh, that. I just need that one more time, please. Just breathe with me, because what the fuck did Yungi just do? You just impregnated me through the screen. That's what happened. Oh. <laughs> oh. I know I said one more time, but I really meant like 20. Oh. <laughs> Anyway, as I was saying, there's always like a thing that connects them all. Like the thing that Uni, 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 <gasps> Juni has on his chest is all throughout the rest of them. I think it's on G.A. Jimin's neck. <laughs> yeah, what am I kidding? I need to actually... I'm so happy that like... Oh, that, that I love that. Had Obviously you guys know what the fuck I'm talking about. This... The, with a flick out when they're doing this part, I really love the subtlety of the feet. Like I, I'm sure people have noticed it, but every time I watch it, I've because I've seen this happen so many times. I now watch the bottom half. <sighs> and this is just, you know, this part. This part. The kick. The little kick, it's just a subtle and then the flip out with the foot, like all the girls in the crowd dancing along. Respect. Oh. Uh. I like how they didn't add anything to the stage. Like, they could have overcomplicated it. Like, because the graphics in the back are already so intense. Yeah, Bobby, get your ish. Yeah, so it must have been, for some reason, in that last video. It, like, skipped in random spots. So that was different. Is that what... They did skip... I just realised they did skip Jungkook. 
I heard someone saying that they did, but they have. They went to the book part. See? Yeah. Why? I don't understand why. Was it a timing thing? Like they ran out of time? I don't know how I feel about that. Like, I don't, I understand if it was a timing thing, but it just feels weird not hearing his part now. Appreciate the boys dancing in the crowd. I love that there's other light sticks and stuff in the crowd. Yeah, and then this weird cut. I feel like that didn't flow the way the song did. Go, Jin! Oh. That's a good angle where they're actually showing like the, the density of how many people are on stage. It must be so goddamn hot with all those lights and like they're just wearing suits. Like they're wearing three layers of suits. They're wearing full suits. The only thing they're not wearing is like the waistcoat. Oh. I'm so glad he decided to he made the executive decision to dye his hair back. Like, I love him with light hair, but I just, I love Jin with his normal hair. Oh, look at our glorious leader. Who said that, that was an appropriate pose? I did. Can I just say something? Thank you so much for watching. You want to see more? Okay, no, I don't really kind of lost the appeal. <laughs> that was really interesting. I I um I had heard bits and pieces about the um America's Got Talent performance that there was parts skipped. I'm I'm curious as to why they were skipped. Like I said earlier, if they were skipped for the purpose of timing in the sense that they had a very short um, time slot where they could fit BTS's performance in considering it was a pre-recorded performance from what I'm aware. Um, I think on the first video I watched at the bottom it said it was pre-recorded. Um, I keep going to fix my glasses and I realize I've got contact lenses in. Um, I mean, like, BTS, in a BTS performance they always, like, their performances never disappoint. Their choreography is pretty damn always near on point. There's been a few points, obviously. It's not a perfect every bloody time. Vocals were great. I don't think there was much, if any, backing tracks. Like, I've heard them live myself, so I know the standard that they have. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if there was minimal backing tracks, just because there is obviously the high-pitched point for Jimin. Um, I don't think he relied completely on a backing track. I feel like he did actually do that live um i have to listen back to that again and check but you know what it's a high note you're dancing a really like difficult choreography like i'm not going to criticize someone for using a minimal backing track when really mostly bts never performs without one i mean we all know the iconic mic drop moment with my man's min Yungi after he got <laughs> you know accused of that um i'm really glad that um they performed on this. Obviously, America's Got Talent has a really big platform. Their viewership is a lot bigger than things like the BBMAs and the AMAs. Um, I know people lost their crap when that happened, so for them to be on something like America's Got Talent is an amazing step for them. Um, and I know as well that there's no plans for them to release anything in English, and I'm completely okay with that. They're a Korean pop band. Um, they do speak English occasionally, they do write parts of their songs in English, but every K-pop group does. Most Asian pop groups do. Um, I've listened to it at K-pop, which is Kazakhstan pop, M-pop, which is Mando pop, and J-pop, which is J Japanese pop. So they all feature English. Um, just because they do that doesn't mean they have to release an album in English. Um, I like that they're keeping their identity. I think that's part of what Idol, the whole thing, was about. That at the end of the day... They are still Korean people. Um, but yeah, I of course love that. Um, if you couldn't tell, 
Um, that was great. If you enjoyed my reaction, please give me a thumbs up down below. Hit subscribe if you are new to the family. We would love to have you. I hope you're having a good day or night wherever you are. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.